Hey guys, it's Alex, and today I'm gonna to be showing you how to set up the facial recognition on your new 2021 Subaru Forester. Uh, this feature will allow you to use your, uh, they call it driver focus, so it will help detect distracted driving or if somebody's falling asleep at the wheel. Uh, in addition to that, it will set up the convenience of setting your memory position and your uh, seat position so you don't have to reset it each time you get in the car. And you can do this up to five people or five different profiles on the car. So uh, let's hop in, I'll show you how to do this. Also, if you guys are new to my channel, please don't forget to subscribe and smash the like button if you get value out of today's video. If you have any questions at the end of today's video, then leave them down in the comment section below. I'm also going to be making uh, my next video on how to set up the facial recognition for the uh, 2021 Outback Touring. So if you wanna check that out, I'll leave a link to that in the description below. All right, so let's go ahead and get in. And the first thing we're going to want to do is we'll start the car up. I'm gonna roll the windows down. It's about 73-ish degrees today here in Louisville, Kentucky. It's a really nice day, but it is getting warm. So I'm gonna show you guys, I'm going to adjust my seat where I like it and I'm also going to use this over here to adjust my mirrors I'm gonna do the left and the right and also we're gonna put it in reverse keep your foot on the brake and we're going to also adjust the uh, mirror here when we go into reverse because the mirrors tilt whenever you put it into reverse so we're going to get those to where we like them and then I'm going to put it back in park and now I'm going to go into the settings of the infotainment up here to show you exactly how to uh, set your facial recognition so first I want to show you these controls over here we're going to be using the info button and then we're going to use this up arrow the down arrow and this select button the select button says i slash set now all of these uh buttons right here uh you just pull up on them to uh select or to to activate that button uh, so for the info button i'm going to show you up here on the screen you just continue to click this and we're looking up here on the screen. Just keep toggling through until you get to this screen where it says push and hold info button for selection screen. So I'm gonna try to show you guys this. Click and hold and look at that top screen, it'll change. So now we are in the settings screen where we can edit uh, our settings and set up our driver recognition now now we're going to use these keys down here so toggle up and down with those up and down arrows and then the set slash select button so we're going to toggle down at this point we've already set our it's important to do your mirror position and your seating position first before you get into this menu uh, otherwise whenever you come into this by the time you uh, fool with uh, setting that, it will it'll time out and then you'll have to just redo it. So we set all that up in the beginning. Now we are just going to click this set button in the middle and it's going to go into that driver monitoring system. We're gonna use the down arrow to click and register user. Uh, so driver A is already set in here where I did this before. I'm just going to go in and do uh, a second a driver profile. Now, I think I mentioned this before, but you can do up to five profiles in here. So five different drivers. So I'm just going to go and select number two. Now we've we've already set all of our mirror and, and seat position. So now we just uh, click that center button over here on the left side of the steering wheel. This right here to click set. And then now I'm just going to face forward and wait for the uh, car to beep. 
So this, this infrared bar up here is projecting out and it has to be able to see your face, you're facing uh, forward or towards it to recognize it. So now it's in the screen where I can edit my name. I'm just gonna toggle all the way over because we don't need to set that for today's purposes. And I'm just gonna set driver B. So now my, uh, my setup is complete says hello driver B you can also change that little icon there too which is cool if you want to personalize it so now I'm going to open the door I'm gonna mess with my seat and I'm gonna close the door and we are going to just wait for this up here to recognize my face it's doing it now it's moving the seat automatically it says hello driver B and so yeah it moved my seat it also moves your mirror position too so um, it's kind of hard to show I'll try to I'll show you guys I'm gonna mess with the mirror I'm gonna get it in a funky position and I'm gonna open the door I'm gonna close it now it thinks there's now it thinks there's a new driver and as soon as I look forward that mirror just automatically adjust so there you have it guys that's how you set up your driver focus now i'll also show you since i'm gonna have to delete these users i'm gonna show you we're gonna click info go back into this screen i'm gonna show you how to delete users so we're gonna toggle down to the driver monitoring system we're gonna toggle down we're gonna pass up user and we're gonna do delete all users click yes and so all users have been deleted. So now when we go back down here to register user, you don't see driver A or driver B in there anymore. So there you have it. That's how you set it up. Now this feature does work with sunglasses. I actually have sunglasses on today. The first driver that I set that you saw in there, driver A, I set that without my sunglasses. And I set driver B with sunglasses. You don't have to have two set. You can just do driver A, set that, and it should work with or without sunglasses. And I don't know how well this works. I only have this one pair to test it out. I mean, these are a uh, like a light brown. So maybe if you have really dark lenses, it might not work, but I'm not 100% sure. But I thought that was a cool thing to note that these do work with sunglasses. So that is it for this video. If you want to see the same feature on the 2021 Outback, then click that YouTube card above. And uh, if you guys haven't done so already, please subscribe to the channel. Smash the like button if you got value out of this video. And uh, hope you guys have a great day. I will see you in the next one.